Welcome back to Solid Cam Pro. In this exercise, we are going to create clamp coupling. And here we have this drawing, and we are going to follow step by step in order to create our model. So let's start to follow this one. We have from the center 90 millimeter, and the height for this one 50 millimeter. Distance from here to to here 50 millimeter and from the center it is one 50 millimeter and we have here 80 millimeter and the total length is 145 millimeter and we have this thickness 42.5 millimeter and this hole is 65 millimeter in diameter so let's start to create new sketch Select from plane, draw line, define. 90 millimeter, 50 millimeter, 50 millimeter, and the distance from here up to here 50 millimeter. This 80 millimeter. Eighty millimeter, and the distance from here up to here seventy five millimeter. Draw another line. Define forty two point five. Select trim command, convert this to construction line, finish sketch. Select revolve command, here we have this profile and here we have this axis. Now we are going to add this cutout. Uh, for this one we have 80 and here 80 millimeter. So let's start to create new sketch here. Draw a line. Draw another line. Offset 40 millimeter and 40 millimeter. The same for this one. Add a circle. Delete. The center line select trim command you just can drag like this like this one finish sketch select extrude cut select 
all profile here select the distance up to here okay select this one and create new sketch go align let's go let's select offset 3 millimeter and 3 millimeter select a circle finish select extrude cap the distance of this cutout is 112 millimeter 112 millimeter downward we see here this is this cutout 112 millimeter and this is the distance from here to here six millimeter and now let's select another sketch here draw a line Select rectangle, define four and six. And let's select the center to the center and select for incident. Constraint and now we can delete this one, extend not working, just delete this line and this line for a line from here up to here. Finish a sketch, extrude cap, and this cap out is sixty millimeter dips okay you can see here this is 60 millimeter dips and now let's add some hole here select circle offset 20 millimeter wire right line select print come on draw a circle 14 millimeter delete this one and delete this one select rectangular pattern select this circle axis 6 4 ok finish select extrude cut select all these profiles cut the distance up to here 
Okay. This looks fine. And now we are, we are going to add some fillet. Before adding this fillet, we are going to add some hole here. Select this. Create new sketch. Draw a line from this center. Select project geometry. Draw a line. Convert to construction line. Draw circle. Select this one. Center. The center. The center. Define. Call millimeter twelve millimeter this one twelve millimeter now the distance from here up to here fifteen millimeter the distance from here to here twenty five millimeter and the distance from here up to here twenty five millimeter and the last one 15 millimeter. Finish sketch. Select extrude cap. Select this profile. And select this one up to this surface. Okay. And now select this plane. Make it visible. Select mirror command and select this plane. Okay. Hide this plane. And now we are going to add some fillet. This one, two millimeter. Two millimeter. Select fillet again, 5 mm and select chamfer, select this one, this one, this one, this one, this one, this one. This one. Apply. Assign material. Iron cast. Change the color. Aluminium polish. And now we are going to save our model. Five zero zero two. And now we are going to create assembly. Select this one, standard. Amen. Select this one place and select our model this one Okay Select shaded with edit It is a little bit more clear And now we are going to add some bolts here Select we are going to save this model first.
and now because we have the hole is already finished so just we are going to select concentric this one select this face select the circle just select this circle termination plane select this one and now I have uh, created before some profile is Bluetooth connection profile but we can do new one just select bolt let's click another time select this pole and now we are going to add washer select this one and select this the bolt in this washer is from this side and this washer is from this side as we see in the preview add notch select this one you see those two from this side and this one two from this side this one and this one and now let's create a profile add m10 so apply select again this space select circle terminate this one and select this profile apply select again this face and this circle and this one this one apply select this one select this So now our model is finished. This is a simple model just uh, we have created. We have the dimension for this hole, everything here, distance, everything here. So I hope you like this video and thank you for watching.